Blessed greetings, and welcome to another edition of Ellen White Speaks. Today, I will read from her devotional, That I May Know Him, from Monday, September 4th, 2023. This is entitled, The March to Victory. But thanks be to God, which giveth us the victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. 1 Corinthians chapter 15, verse 57. Nothing can be more helpless, nothing can be more dependent than the soul that feels its nothingness and relies wholly upon the merits of the blood of a crucified and risen Savior. The Christian life is a life of warfare, of continual conflict. It is a battle and a march. But every act of obedience to Christ every act of self-denial for his sake, every trial well endured, every victory gained over temptation is a step in the march to the glory of final victory. If we take Christ for our guide, he will lead us safely along the narrow way. The road may be rough and thorny. The ascent may be steep and dangerous. There may be pitfalls upon the right hand and upon the left we may have to endure toil in our journey. When weary, when longing for rest, we may have to toil on. When faint, we may have to fight. When discouraged, we may be called upon to hope. But with Christ as our guide, we shall not lose the path to immortal life. We shall not fail to reach the desired haven at last. Christ himself has trod the rough pathway before us and has smoothed the path for our feet. The narrow path of holiness, the way cast up for the ransomed of the Lord to walk in, is illuminated by him who is the light of the world. As we follow in his steps, his light will shine upon us, and as we reflect the light borrowed from the glory of Christ, the path will grow brighter and brighter upon the perfect day. We may think it pleasant at first to follow pride and worldly ambition, but the end is pain and sorrow. Selfish plans may present flattering promises and hold out the hope of enjoyment, but we shall find that our happiness is poisoned and our life embittered by hopes that center in self. In following Christ, we are safe, for he will not suffer the powers of darkness to hurt one hair of our heads. He will keep that which is committed to his trust, and we shall be more than conquerors through him that loved us. That was taken from That I May Know Him, a devotional by Ellen G. White, entitled The March of to victory for Monday, September 4th, 2023. Thank you for listening and have a blessed week.